A million UK military veterans have faced mental health woes, a harrowing report says. Researchers found almost 40% of the 2.5 million ex-forces community have suffered depression, anxiety, alcoholism or post-traumatic stress. It shows veterans are twice as likely to develop mental health problems compared to people on Civvy Street. The report, in the British Medical Journal and based on records of 2,500 ex-personnel, warned those who see combat are most likely to be hit. Researchers found 44% of female veterans and 38% of men were affected. Depression is most common at 18% equal to almost half a million veterans. Over 17% also struggled with alcohol. The figures may provide some explanation as to why so many veterans have taken their lives. Marine Sergeant Major Jeff Williams, Image, Sunday Mirror. Since 2017 more than 350 veterans and service personnel are feared to have killed themselves. The Sunday People Save Our Soldiers campaign calls on the government to provide better treatment for past and present forces members. Former Royal Marine Sergeant Major Jeff Williams, 65, was diagnosed with PTSD 40 years after fighting in the Falklands War. Jeff, who is married and from Birmingham, runs the support group Veterans United Against Suicide. Many soldiers report being depressed, stock image, image, Getty images, iStock photo. He said, I think anyone who has served and seen some unpleasant stuff probably has some form of PTSD. I served in Hong Kong. We had to fish the bodies of babies out of rivers, dropped by mothers trying to escape from China. That sort of thing never leaves you. A few months ago I started having really bad nightmares. I became withdrawn, couldn't face the idea of going out and just felt quite vulnerable. Most read. Russia says it will not forget Britain's support for Ukraine in biggest threat yet. UK and US special forces preparing for high-risk rescue of Ukrainian president. Deadly RAF beast mode fighter jets that will make Putin sweatland in UK. My doctor said I was suffering from depression and had PTSD. I felt I got treatment just in time, along with the support of family and veterans groups. Who knows what would have happened if I had waited longer or ignored the signs like so many veterans do. The mod said, well-being is a top priority. Former service personnel can access specialist care from the NHS, including via the Veterans Gateway at veteransgateway.org.uk, and Every part of the UK now has a dedicated mental health service for veterans. For current personnel we provide a package of support including mental health tools, fitness briefs and a 24-hour mental health helpline. Read more. Soldiers fear pandemic of suicide at army barracks after two sudden deaths in 48 hours. Read more. Mod driving soldiers to self-harm and suicide as helpline fails injured veterans.